Hey guys, welcome back to my channel at Sister Girl Talk TV. So, whew, guys, first I want to just say, Maxine Waters, I salute you, Queen. I salute you. My hat goes off to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for standing up and speaking up and saying something and and like just speaking up for the for, for the Haitian migrants like what they did to them at that border it, it it's just disgusting if you i mean oh my god i don't even know where to begin like this is outrageous if you like any one of us can relate to being treated. If you are a, a minority, then you understand why she, why Maxine Waters is outraged. I'm outraged. You get her outraged if you are a minority because to treat people that way, oh my God, that, I mean, they showed that one clip you know, with them on the horse with that whip, but mm -mm. he, it was more than one out there on those horses with those whips. It, 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 it's just, it was just so sad and oh my God, just pouring outrage, just watching and seeing those people falling and tumbling over themselves and running with their children. It, th that is disgusting. It's just, it's disgusting disgusting to see something like this in our country like like we have to do better i'm with you maxine you are right she's right guys we need to step up we need to we need to speak out we need to let our voices be heard we need to scream this from the highest mountain we need to talk about this this needs to be something that we discuss. This needs to be something that needs to be talked about. This is why I wanted to come here and bring this video and talk about this with you guys and give my opinion and get you guys opinion. So I would hope that you would, you know, drop down there in that comment box and give your opinions and we can talk about this together, you know, because this is ridiculous. You know, just some weeks ago, Juliana, Julia, what what, what is her name? Uh, Juliana or Julia um, um, Ansley from NSBC, um, she was just talking about how, you know, how we basically fallen for the banana in the tailpipe, how things are, we're just being, just bamboozled, you know, Biden promised temporary protective um, statues, but psh, what he did leave out, he left one thing out that it only applied to the Haitians that lived here, that was already here, you know, so we, you know, we just, I, I, I'm not really like a political person, I don't like really like to talk about politics, I pretty much try to stay politically incorrect because, or politically correct, however you want to say it, because I don't dig deep into politics because I don't want to be talking about things that I don't have full knowledge of or done full research about, but this right here, we need to talk about this. We, this is something that we need to talk about. This is something that needs to be out there. And we, and she's right. Maxine is right. We need to talk about it. We need to scream it and shout it from the highest mountain. We need to do that. I'm going to play this, this clip for those of you that didn't watch it and, and hear what, you know, what Maxine Waters had to say when she got down on Biden and them. You know, because something has to go, something has to give. So I'm, a, I'm you know, I'm just going to woo -sai and I'm going to, you know, let you guys listen and I'm going to listen to. And I want to thank uh, Miss Beatty uh, for the leadership that they're providing on this issue. I'm pissed. I'm unhappy. Yeah, and me I'm not too. just unhappy with the cowboys mm. who were running down Haitians. That part. Using their reins to whip them. That I'm part. 
administration. Mm-hmm. We are following the Trump policy. He is the one that does not follow the Constitution and would not allow those seeking refuge to be able to petition to get into the country. Right. What the hell are we doing here? Mm-hmm. What we witness takes us back hundreds of years. Yeah, what that's we disgusting. Was worse than what we witnessed in slavery. Cowboys with their reins again whipping black people, mm, patients, mm, mm, mm. into the water where they're scrambling and falling down. And all they're trying to do is escape from violence in their country. Right. Yes, it is unfortunate. The president the died. The poorest country in this hemisphere. It is unfortunate that they have no stable government right, right now. It is unfortunate that they've had to live through 